The COVID-19 pandemic has brought PCR testing into the limelight like never before. So how does a PCR test actually work? PCR tests detect the presence or absence of a particular piece of DNA. Every living thing has a unique DNA code. That includes you and me, but also all viruses and bacteria. So if you can detect virus DNA in a sample, then you can be sure that that sample contains the virus itself. DNA is made up of two strands of bases in an order completely unique to the organism that it comes from. If you heat DNA in the lab, two strands separate. A PCR test then contains small DNA tags called primers that are designed to bind specifically to the target DNA that you're trying to detect. If you cool the DNA in the lab a little, the primers bind to the virus DNA if it's present. This primer allows an enzyme to bind and duplicate the DNA strand. A second DNA tag, called a probe, gives off a coloured signal when this duplication occurs. By heating and cooling the reaction 40 or 50 times, this chain reaction will amplify the target DNA millions of times, giving off a bright coloured signal that can be monitored by a camera in real time. So, a sample that is positive for the virus of interest gives a signal like this, but a negative sample will give a flat line. Modern laboratory instruments can run hundreds of these chemical reactions at the same time, allowing for very high throughput testing. The UCIC COVID-19 kit comes with primers that detect two different areas of the virus genome for extra diagnostic certainty. Each gives off a different coloured signal. The kit also contains a third set of primers that detect human DNA. This control is a simple way to check that you've got good quality biological material from your swab. So PCR is an incredibly sensitive and unbeatably accurate way to detect the presence or absence of a virus. UC makes these kits for COVID-19, as well as lots and lots of other viruses, bacteria, fungi, and other DNA targets.